Hi, this is John Twalbush from PolicyViz. Thanks so much for tuning into this video to explain the Excel chart styles add-in from myself and John Peltier of Peltier Tech. In this video, I'm going to explain how to use some of the exporting features of the new tool. The exporting menu shows up here in the far right of the chart styles add-in. Uh, you can see that we have three direct options, export to picture, export to PowerPoint, and export to Word. We also have an export settings general menu, and I'm going to select that just to demonstrate the various options that are embedded within this uh, single menu. You can see that we have a bunch of different options for exporting to PowerPoint here on the top, and we also have some options here for uh, exporting to Microsoft Word. So and a user can change these options whether they want to insert the chart object as a Microsoft object, which works on PCs that you can then edit that graph within PowerPoint or Microsoft, or maybe just as a flat image file, as a PNG, as a GIF, or a JPEG, et cetera, et cetera. You can also have them set up as a new document or an active document, and same thing with PowerPoint. I'm going to leave the settings as they are here already so that I can demonstrate what an analyst or what a user might do when they're creating a chart for the first time. So I'm going to press OK. And I'm going to go over here to this Two Years tab. And just to start, I'm just going to create a simple column chart already set up so that it has the text uh, at the top with the title and the subtitle and at the bottom with the note and the sources and then a logo in the bottom right. So let me export that to PowerPoint. And so if I click the button, what happens is PowerPoint launches automatically and pastes the, the, that chart into a slide. And you can see here that this is now pasted as a Microsoft object, so I can go and edit the different parts of the chart should I need to do that. If I go back to Microsoft Excel, let me create another chart here. I'll create a line chart using these data. Again, I've already selected my different options, so the chart is already uh, fully styled using my organization's colors and font and logo. And if I click the export to Word button, Word is actually going to launch. So I don't have Word open yet. And when I click that button, Word is going to launch and the chart's going to be dropped right into Microsoft Word. And you can see again, because I have it set up as pasting in as a Microsoft object, I can edit any of these objects in the chart itself. If I go back to the Excel, same thing happens if I export as a picture. I can actually save this chart somewhere, say on my desktop. I can name it and I can uh, save it out as, as a specific uh, chart onto my computer. So that's how some of the exporting options work in the new chart styles add-in. Again, as with all of the options in the tool, they can be modified and adapted to the needs of you and your organization. So if you're interested, please do feel, uh, please do reach out to us uh, at policyviz.com and see how we can help you do a better job of communicating your data through data visualization.